Hello everybody and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how you can install and enable texture packs for MCPE or Minecraft Pocket Edition. First thing you're actually going to want is a texture pack, right? And now you probably already have one. If you don't, I'll link a few websites in the description for you. And I actually also make a bunch of texture packs myself. And if you want to check those out, I'll link those in the description for you as well. So the first thing that you really want to do is just make sure that you can locate your um, your, your packs, right? I'm on iOS and if you are too, you want to go into um, this app called Files here. Then you want to go into On My iPhone and then Downloads. And in your downloads right here, you should have um, your packs if you downloaded them from the internet. Otherwise, if you're on Android or if they're not here, make sure that you can locate your packs. All right, I've located my pack right here. It's this one. It's in 64's tool revamp. Um, it's kind of hard to read, but basically it's mine in the bottom left. And if I click on this, it's a Minecraft texture pack. So Minecraft is just automatically going to launch for me. And that's great. But what if that doesn't happen? Well, then what you want to do is you want to press and hold. And then you want to probably click on the share button. The reason I said probably is because depending on your OS or the device you're using, it might be a different button. Either way, you want to make sure that you can see this selection of apps here. And you can scroll here, and then you should actually find Minecraft. Yeah, you can go ahead and click on that, and then it is going to open this file with Minecraft as well. As you can see, my import has started, and it's successfully imported its Me64's tool revamp. That's perfect. Now inside of Minecraft, you want to enable your pack. To do that, you can go over to Settings, then over to Global Resources, and then My Packs. Under that tab, you'll find every single pack you have, including the one we just imported, H64's Tool Revamp. Perfect. You can click on that, and then click on Activate, and then now you can see that it is under the Active tab, which means that it's working. Now make sure that it is at the very top. If it is not at the top, it doesn't have the most priority. Yeah, so if you're having troubles with your packs, make sure that the packs you're having trouble with are at the very top of this line here. Yeah, anyways, we can exit out of that. It's going to load up the resources, and our pack is now going to be enabled. However, there is actually also a second way to um, enable a pack. So to do that, you can just enter into the edit menu of any world, go over to resource packs on the left side, you want to scroll down a bit to do that, and then you want to go over to your packs, just like we did before, and just activate whichever pack you want. Yeah, once again, make sure that it's at the top, and basically what this method is going to do is it's going to enable this pack for this world, so every time that you load up this world, this pack is going to be enabled. The way we just did it earlier through general settings here, um, that's just going to allow you to use this pack with any world here that you load up, including friends worlds, realms, as well as servers. Anyways, that was basically it. Thank you ever so much for watching, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.